Alcazar is a whole other story. That hostage crisis was not Lorenzo's fault. He knew people were willing to kill for what was in that briefcase. He didn't have to store it in the Metro Court vault knowing he was putting a hotel full of people in danger. How can you be such a hypocrite? Willing to navigate Stay. his life in bits and pieces. I should think you of all people would get that, Jason. He doesn't know who we can trust. He doesn't even know who his enemies take are. Take him and your daughter and leave town instead of trying to run a business that you had no experience with. Just until Lorenzo recovers, okay? We just need a little more time. Just, Sonny will listen to you. Just get him I, to back off. I'm sorry. I have no reason to protect Alcazar. You heartless bastard. We're family. Not about this. I come in peace. What the hell is that? That? Yeah, that spasm. What is it? No, it's the, um, the... Come on, it's the Gordonian evasive maneuver, you know, to dodge bullets. It helps if you move at the speed of the light, though. Hey, don't, don't sneak up on me. Again, okay? Yeah, I got it, dude. So, uh... <sighs> hey, what is this place? An old nightclub in Kelly's basement? It's all kind of atmospheric and <laughs> mysterious. Uh, I didn't even know it was here. That's the idea. Yeah. So I was headed to Kelly's and, and I saw you kind of sneak down the alley, so I, yeah. I followed. Don't, don't ever follow me again. But Stone Cold, we're, I mean, we're a pretty awesome team. You know, I mean, remember when we snuck into the Metro Court and, and, and fought the unhinged one in the Minions of Darkness? I mean, I was like, the, you know, the sidekick to your superhero or the, you know, the brain inside your brain. Yeah, yeah, I know that, but you know if I need your help, I'm going to ask for it, right? Yeah, I know. I, but I mean, those times that you so smoothly sneak off on your own, you know, you could use a little tech support. I don't want to put you at risk, okay? Following me is a good way to get yourself killed. Message received. It's like this, it's like this place dropped through a rift in the space-time continuum. <laughs> Yeah, whatever. No, I mean, it's like, it, 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 it's like from another time, you know, a room from another century. You know, I mean, the bar and the tables, it's, I mean, who, who owned it? Okay, listen to me. I know you get excited about things, but you were never here. This place has been forgotten about for a long time, and it needs to stay that way. change my mind just because he comes in here selling me this garbage about being a better father to, to Molly and not wanting to hurt Alexis any more than he already has. If Rick double crosses me, it's just another day at the office. And you know what? We'll be ready. I saw Sky. What she want? <sighs> she, uh, wanted me to ask you to let her run officer's business without <laughs> retaliation. Come on, you're not, you're not asking me, are you? No. He came in here, right? I pushed him. See if I can... Can't really tell. Okay, well, with Rick watching us, taking shipments, you know, what about the idea about shutting down until officer's taken care of? If we shut down, that's kind of a sign of weakness. We got we to we just go ahead and do business as usual. I may, I may have a way to do that. Business, she's making me look weak and ineffectual. That's the idea, isn't it? Assuming I don't blow my own cover. I almost went for Sonny's throat when he was threatening Sky. I have to be patient. It's close to the waterfront. It's right to the little Kelly's. You know? Well, customers are going to be walking all over the place. So it's going to cover our people's activities. And then we got the service elevator, and that we can use for all our shipments. Yeah, but this is Cody's old nightclub. I mean, we're not the only ones who, who know it's down here. Yeah, but Sonny, this place has been closed for years. Nobody is going to suspect that we're using it. Sonny and Jason think I'm mentally incapacitated. 
incapacitated. I can lure them into complacency and wait for my chance. There's a raid. We're underground. If the exits are sealed off, then we're trapped here. This time, we're not going to leave any room for error. We're going to do this straightforward mob execution style. And we're going to leave their bodies for the police to find. I don't like it. This is a perfect spot for an ambush. On the next general hospital. I will tell everyone that you're a murderer. What's to prevent me from shutting your mouth? You reinforced all the reasons why we can't be together. We have to keep as low profile as we can. How do you feel about Sam McCall's new TV show? Have you called in any favors to make Sam a big star?